and welcome to How to Cook Great Food. With thousands of recipes and millions of views, why not subscribe to our channel and join the family? Welcome back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com. If you have not already, please click that button and subscribe to our channel. On the menu today, and as you can see here, just finished this, got some fish fry. It's a beautiful fish. You can use any fish you want. Today I'm using a black pomfret frit with some beautiful Indian spices on there. Really, really delicious. Let's go and do it. Okay, let's just take a look at some of the ingredients we're going to be using apart from our fish. So I've got here a little bit of flour. I'm using a corn flour or corn starch, but you could use something else if you wanted. Here I've got some lemon juice or lime juice. Over here I've got garlic ginger paste, which is a 50-50 mix of garlic and ginger, salt, pepper. And then here I've got some coriander powder, like one teaspoon like this. Here I've got one chili powder, again one teaspoon like that. And turmeric or haldi, two teaspoons, because we're gonna use it twice. Once to put on the fish and then once to make the masala to go on the top. Okay, let's take a look at our fish. So the fish I'm using today is a black pomfret, frit, but you can use any fish for this. Whole, you know, sardines or salmon or kingfish. Entirely up to you what you want to use. I'm just using this today. So as you can see, I've got skin on one side. Again, you can have skin, no skin, complete fillet if you want to. Simply in a bowl, we're going to add that lemon or lime juice. We're going to add a little bit of salt. And half of our turmeric. Now what I want to do is just rub this around, throw it around in there and then we're going to set this aside just for about 5 to 10 minutes, just get a cover on it and just kind of get it on the, on the, on the, on the refrigerator and then we're good to go. Okay now we're going to make uh, the masala paste for our fish, so we'll start off with our coriander powder our chilli powder, our turmeric, a little bit of black pepper, a little bit of salt, our garlic ginger paste, a little splash of water, just to kind of get that paste happening. I'm just simply going to mix this around. Now you could be adding other things to this. You could add in some garam masala powder if you wanted, or cumin powder. Just a little touch more. We don't want this too thin. We want it to kind of stick to the fish, of course. But that's a nice little consistency. Great. Let's move on. Okay, so now for that little bit of flour, like I said, I'm using a corn flour or corn starch today. We're just going to simply take our fish, give it a little light coating, like that. Let me do these, then I'll be back. Okay, just a little sprinkle of flour on there. Some people also put some semolina on it or something like that. Uh, flour works just fine for me. Now simply, we're going to get our masala. We're going to get it on there. And we've just got to rub that all around on both sides of the fish. So again, let me get on with that. Make sure I do the sides as well. And then we'll get over to the cooker. Okay, here we go then. So I've got a frying pan here with you know a little bit of oil in. Some people would use much more oil on that and kind of deep fry them. Some would use a tiny amount, so I'm kind of in the middle here, but that's up to you. Now, sunflower oil I'm using today, canola, vegetable, corn, all fine. Simply, I'm gonna get our fish and there it goes. Now, depending on the type of fish you've used, it depends on how long you're going to cook your fish for. With my fish, I'm going to do this for about three to four minutes on each side. 
and I'm only going to turn it once. Uh, if it sticks, like it's sticking there, just leave it, it will just release itself, don't start pushing it around. So three minutes, I'm going to flip it. Okay, there we go. Out they come. And like I said, depending on the type of fish that you've used, depending on how long you're going to cook it for. Beautiful. Let's get that on a little bit of paper towel, get some of that excess oil off, then we can serve it. Okay, and there you go. So, so simple. Really, really delicious. I'm serving this just in the centre there with a bit of a chilli and cilantro or coriander chutney. Lots of mint and that in there. Really delicious. In fact, I'll stick the recipe for that up. It will pop up in a moment for you. Like I say, easy peasy. Play around with it. Really delicious. I love this one. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'll see you soon. Lots of love. With thousands of recipes and millions of views, why not subscribe to our channel and join the family?